Yeah. Tell us about this shirt. I've seen this shirt around. I've seen this around. Uh, yeah, we got it like midway through the season. Um, tell me, uh, like, uh, I know we were on a roller all the time, so just like, keep the train rolling, you know? Just keep on, like, just keep on going. That's like, it's really simple, but, uh, yeah, just keep on going. I got over here late. Have you decided anything about next year? Uh, no, I have not decided. Uh, I know I have like a month to decide. So, uh, you have yeah, yeah. a time frame when you want to make a decision? Uh, no, not really. I'm probably going to wait like kind of last minute. To when? Kind of like towards like the end of it. So you're going to wait after the bowl game? Yeah, probably after the bowl game. What are you weighing? What are you, who are you leaning on to make decisions? I got people in the building. Uh, I got people, I got family, uh, scouts, where they feel like I'll be right now. And, uh, yeah. Um, what kind of feedback have yeah. you gotten from yeah. scouts? Yeah. Um, like that would be a late round guy right now. And uh, if I come back, I can improve my stock a lot more. Uh, just because... Like they finally, like they barely uh, start hearing about me this year. Yeah. So, uh, um, but no, yeah. Whether I go now or next year, I'm still playing football at the end of the day. So, uh, and I'm blessed regardless. Because uh, you know, come back, I'm here in Iowa. Is this stressful at all? Uh, it, it can be if you don't like, you just don't really control it. You know, in the sense of just think about it too much. And, yeah. Have you been able to push it out of your mind and kind of just I, play, play, at play first, football? Yeah, at first it was like on my mind a lot and. Uh, no, it's not, I'm starting, starting to lay back. We got to, it's kind of, uh, it's got to be cool to be in this position considering uh, it took so long for you to get on the field here. Mm -hmm. No, yeah, it's definitely a position I always wanted to be in, especially as a kid. So, uh, no, I'm here now. So, uh, I'm just, yeah, enjoying it. And, uh, yeah, I'm just going to do what's best for me at the end of the day. How much are you guys talking about it? The group of guys that that could come back, Jay and uh, yeah, we've been talking about it. We've been talking about it. Uh... <laughs> what are you guys comparing when you talk about it? What do you guys talk about when you talk about it? Did you say, "Hey, let's all come back together. Let's, you know." Uh, well, yeah, but some some guys can't, and some guys can't come back in a sense. Yeah. So like those guys, that, you know, the, the, the guys are out, they're out. You know, they can't come yeah. back. But uh, um. Yeah, guys are getting old too. <laughs> so, uh, I, you know, I can't say too much for them. I'll let them say it for themselves when you guys interview them. But, yeah, guys are getting old. Um, uh, but it would be cool, like, for us to come back and really just do it again. Um, that's, like, the biggest thing why we all want to come back. Just do it again and play for each other. How would you describe the guys in the He's a great coach. Um, he has a great philosophy, and he has his own way of like coaching, right? And uh, I mean, yeah, he does his he does his things like his own way. I mean, he, he's learning for someone, but uh, it works. And uh, he's an intense guy. He can be, he can't be intense, but he can also be the opposite. So uh, no, he's a great coach. He knows what he's doing. And, uh, he's finally getting the credit that he, uh, he deserves.